document on this phone also. I went to go get the inner tie rod and removal tool and um, I noticed in the kit, at least with the cylinder design um, that has the inserts, they only had a 29 mil, I think it was a 32 mil. They didn't have what I was wondering and I guessed was uh, 30 mil. Uh, the one, uh, oh, was it one and three sixteenths was the closest. I thought it was a little sloppy. Now, however, I removed that with this crescent wrench. And I'm like in there and I wound up getting, instead of the $90 lease, he said I can just buy this. And, you know, as long as it's not bad condition, when I bring it back, I can return it in 30 days. So I'm like, I'll just buy that for $21. And that got me thinking, well, you know, when I was looking at this, those little pieces are sort of like a crow's foot. And they're calling it a crow's foot in the kit, but they're not the crow's foot with the three uh, eighths inch female, you know, square uh, socket interface. So I'm like, well, hey, these are $21. I can get one of these 12 inches ones for $21. I get EDM a 3 8 inch or a half inch here and potentially build up this little, you know, the teeth treatment might not be so great. It might be worth, you know, it might be worthwhile to anneal, weld, clean, reheat, treat again, you know, so it's uh, uh, re-annealed, uh, hardened, uniform. But um, build this up. Then I also was thinking, well, man, I could also just weld a socket right onto that section cut the rest off and then there's a variable crow's foot. I've never seen one of those before. So I'm like, dude, did I just come up with an invention? So I don't know, let's see if they're on the market, if there's a patent anywhere, but at least get a copyright one. <laughs> but, uh, you know, it's, it's an implied now explicit. So, but yeah, the crow's foot would be 30. Um, so, you know, I'm thinking me for this uh, in the future, I'm probably, I was going to buy a crow's foot, but now I'm thinking I'm going to make a variable crow's foot. I'm going to double check and see if there's enough room in there. Um, might even be enough room to get that crescent in, but I wanted to make sure I had the tool, you know, to go ahead and um, uh, disassemble everything and reassemble without any issues and the specification um, all, you know, in one time. So I don't have to take the truck out and just get this wrapped up and I'm good to go for the day. Uh, other than that, I can't think of anything else. Be safe, stay healthy, and learn something new.